When it comes to improving your health, improving your focus, improving your energy, dropping your waistline, melting the belly flat, whatever it is, however you want to see progression, whether you want to feel better, whether you want more energy, whether you want more focus, more motivation, all this stuff, we as human beings tend to overcomplicate things. And it's so easily done. We see in the media we have to do this sort of diet, that sort of diet. We see on social media that we have to do this sort of diet or that sort of diet or try this or try that. 50 different things at once. We have to get the minimal amounts done. Those 1% changes, done. But we forget one thing. The easiest thing. And that is reaching out and grabbing that low hanging fruit. You see, I've been, oh, I've done it the worst. I've done it so many times where I think there's gonna be some hack. There's gonna be some thing that I can do that's gonna outweigh all this other stuff that are the basics, that are that low hanging fruit. So why do we overcomplicate it? And the problem with overcomplicating things is that we end up getting overwhelmed. And then we go backwards rather than forwards. We end up putting on more weight, not doing anything, not getting to the gym, not being able to fit it into our schedule, not eating that good food. Because it is so damn overwhelming. So whether you're looking to improve your health, drop fat or anything like that. Look at the low hanging fruit first. How can you get more steps in? Just simply tracking your steps first off. So you can see, oh, you're doing 7,000. Maybe tomorrow I can get 7,500 in. Another walk around the block, take a slightly longer route around the store. Easy to get those extra steps in. It soon adds up. Those small changes soon add up. Park a little further away from the store. Spend an extra two or three minutes on that treadmill, simply walking whilst you're texting your friend back. How about with food? You don't have to go through these crazy diets where it comes to going zero carb to go into ketogenesis to lose fat. You simply have to know what you're eating. So tracking your food first is a good start. Then maybe cutting three, four, five hundred calories out. Starting with 200 calories out. Switching your sugar to sweetener. Switching your Coke to Diet Coke. Simple, small changes make a massive difference. And you don't even notice these changes as well. Getting hydrated, getting your sleep in, laughing a lot, having sex, things that are gonna lower your stress levels. So many different things that are simply low hanging fruit when it comes to dropping fat. When it comes to losing that belly when it comes to optimizing your energy, your focus. You haven't got to stress about putting this oil in that water and drink it at 17.5 minutes past the hour on the fourth hour of the day, three hours after you wake up. No. You haven't got to worry about having 17.352 grams of protein per meal. No. Simply getting your protein in through the day. Getting clean, healthy food in. And by clean, healthy food, I don't mean to say these substitutes or anything like that, but real food, single ingredient foods, if it's breathed, if it's lived, if it's come from the ground, good foods like that. Get them in, base your diet around those. And yes, you need to know how many calories are going in and roughly how many calories are going out, just so you can adjust it. Find your starting point and the biggest thing the biggest thing is to get accountable. The easiest low hanging piece of fruit, it's not counting your calories, it's not counting your food, it's not even counting your steps or anything like that. Simply, simply getting accountable. If you want some of that accountability, then drop me a message. Now, I'm not gonna be the coach for every single person out there. I'm absolutely amazing at what I do. One of the best around, but you're not gonna be necessarily the client for me. Give me a shout, let's see if we are a fit.
to work together on your goals. Get those low hanging fruits and get that accountability to optimize your health now. I will look forward to speaking to you.